Today the customer was fortunate enough to have a three phase which gave the ability to go up to a 7 kilowatt inverter and allow us to chuck 9.3 kilowatts worth of PV on the roof which is around 27 uh, 345s. The house has basically got uh, a near perfect pitch facing north, uh, which is really great for installing solar panels obviously. So where we've actually pinpointed to put the solar is basically where there's no shading at all and um, the best outcome will happen due to the sun being able to hit those panels all day long without any shading issues. Working with this particular customer, she wanted uh, quality, reliability and efficiency. The first uh, brand that came to mind obviously was LG, the LG 345 uh, Neon 2 uh, basically ticked all three of those boxes so um, she went with that. Customers like this we really love to work with because they want quality and LG gives us the ability to offer quality and give them confidence for the future. So return on investment for a property like this is around three years. In Darwin we're still experiencing a one-for-one -one tariff uh, which basically means you will sell your power back to the grid for the same price that you purchase it for. The residential sector really looks for maximising their system straight off the bat. So commonly we'll install 5 kilowatt inverter on a single phase and a 7 kilowatt on a 3 phase, pump that up to 9.3 or, or 6.6. Um, out of that the customer um, obviously makes around you know 30 to 43 kilowatt hours uh, per day and it saves them anywhere from 700 to 900 dollars a quarter. For the end consumer she has three phase which is great which means we can upgrade the system to a 7 kilowatt inverter and go up to around 9.3 kilowatts worth of PV uh, on the roof. Uh, for a single phase we would usually do a 5 kilowatt with around 6.6 .6 kilowatts so the advantage is to grab that extra 3 kilowatts and um, really create more power.